I like to introduce my students to the work that historians actually do and to the way that we think about the world. So there's always a, a lecture component and there's always exams in my courses, but I try to give students the opportunity to work more hands-on in doing the kind of research that I do. So I can bring in uh, documents for them to look at. I can guide them through the process of designing a research project and carrying it through to its conclusion. And so actually the kind of research that I'll be doing this summer can sometimes help me with that because I'll bring in things um, that I find in, in the uh, research that I do in the archives to allow them to look at it. Those are kind of the, the raw materials that um, history is, is written from. I'm going to make two trips this summer uh, with the money from the summer stipend. I'll travel to the University of Chicago which holds the, um, all of the papers um, related to Senator uh, Stephen Douglas, who is one of the central figures of my book. He's probably best known for the, being Abraham Lincoln's debate uh, rival, um, but he had a whole, a whole career of his own that's really at the center of, of my book. And then I'll also go to Houston to Rice University, which has a similar collection of papers belonging to Jefferson Davis, who, again, is most uh, most famous as the president of the Confederacy, but before that was a U.S. senator and a great rival of Stephen Douglas. And so Davis and Douglas are the, the central characters in the, the book that I'm working on.